Many of you may plan to head out to Christmas tree farms today. It may be harder to find that perfect spruce this year, and it could cost you more, too. The shortage has nothing to do with all the supply chain issues. This is because of the recession a decade ago. A tree takes 10 to 12 years to fully grow. During the recession, farmers couldn't furnish nurseries adequately. We've seen this shortage for the last year or so as a result. One farmer in Nuevo County says things were so strained last year, he had to end the season before December. He says the shortage will likely impact the industry for a couple more years. The shortages aren't good because if you've got to turn people away and they have to go somewhere else, uh, you don't know if you're going to get them customers back again. If they find they go someplace else and they like that better, they do something better than we do, you might not get them back. Trees will also cost more this year as the price to produce new trees recently surged. And things will start to look a lot more festive and green in several cities tonight. Kalamazoo will light its Christmas tree in Bronson Park around 6 o'clock. East Grand Rapids will flip the switch at 6.15. And Hart will have a light parade at 6.30, followed by the tree lighting. Here's the view in downtown Grand Rapids. You can see the, the tree is up and workers will decorate it next week. And we'll flip the switch one week from tonight, live during News 8 at 5. There will be a few light parades next week, too. Monday, Zeeland will light their tree at 6.15, and then the parade will happen after. And I'll be in Holland on Tuesday, along with some other members of Team Daybreak, for that light parade at 6.30.